Top official arrested in Equatorial Guinea with over 400 sex tapes he had with president's sister and other notable women. One of the 400 women confirmed dead through suicide after the tapes were leaked. A husband confronts his wife after seeing her video and she got the shock of her life. C'est toi qui dirige Tams Baby Amour. C'est toi qui dirige Lisette Fashion, Jeanne Fashion, Exotu Kirishi. Tu as appelé le voiture au parking. Tu dis quoi Ok. Hum, Arrête Tiens, non Enlève bien tes lunettes avant de voir la vidéo là. Retire, ne fais pas le semblant avec moi. Regarde la vidéo. Tu te vois, non Hein c'est-à-dire que je suis comme ça à Dubaï en plein centre de travail, en train de vouloir crâner. Mes amis me disent que viens voir la liste de vidéos de Balthazar à Kamba. Je ne peux pas imaginer que tu connais ce gars, même dans mes rêves les plus fous. Donc, sur 400 vidéos, tu as fait toi, toi seul. Et tu lui dis qu'il te trompe l'oreille. Ce que tu m'as jamais dit à moi. Hein, Sarah Je sais pas quoi. Stay with me as I put you through. Baldassar Nganga, the Director General of the National Financial Investigation Agency in Equatorial Guinea, has been arrested for allegedly having extramarital relationships with the sister of the country's president and the wives of notable people. It was learned that the illicit affairs were seen in sex tapes recovered from his house in the course of a fraud investigation against the 54-year-old economist which resulted in the search of his house and office on impromptu notice. The building was searched by anti-graft officials who came across several CDs that later revealed his sexcapades with different married women. The video showed contacts with high-profile individuals such as his brother's wife, his cousin, the president of Equatorial Guinea's sister, the director general of police's wife, and the wives of over 20 of the country's ministries, among others. The film, located in his office, was alleged to have been recorded with his permission and has since been published online, sparking a media frenzy. According to a report by the local media outlet Ahora EG, Nganga has been involved in a sexual scandal unmatched in Equatorial Guinea's history since last October. The former ANIFDG known as Bello, had sexual contact with multiple women, some of whom were married and videotaped these private interactions. The report read, The most striking thing is that some scenes took place in his work office, including moments in which he is seen sleeping with a woman next to the national flag. Based on this sexual scandal, the executive has stated that the measure is a direct response to the acts that have affected the image of the country. With these new measures, the government hopes to establish a clear precedent on the expected conduct of public officials in order to create a more respectful work environment in the public and private administration of Equatorial Guinea. For days now, erotic videos have been circulating on social media featuring Baltasar Ibang Engonga, better known as Bello who is currently the Director General of the National Financial Investigation Agency, ANIF, and is currently imprisoned for alleged corruption issues. This man has a beautiful wife and six children yet he went around sleeping with over 400 women which no one knows his reason for doing such and recording the sex videos on top of that. The incident has caused so many broken homes in Equatorial Guinea and one of the women has committed suicide. We shall follow the story and bring you any updates. Thank you very much for staying with me and please do not forget to subscribe to the channel and follow us wherever you watch our videos. Stay blessed.